We are at the 2022 MPC Wiltshire Nationals, and I'm here with... Paul Oxendine. Ooh, Paul, where are you from? Naples, Florida. Okay, is this your first show, or have you competed before? It's my very first show. So the first show is doing nationals, so how does that make you feel? A little intimidated, but <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not backing down from anything. No, you did a great job, and you showed confidence on stage, so when you're on stage, how did that make you feel looking in the audience? I was just ready to show off what I've been working on in the gym, you know? And just show them that you can't can't stop me. Yeah, so, you know, people saw you on stage, but a lot of people wonder, like, they see you in a wheelchair. So, what happened? Why are you in a wheelchair? I was born like this uh, with a condition called spina bifida. It's where my spine uh, didn't fully form at birth. And uh, so I suffered uh, paralysis from my knees down. Okay, so, you know, you had a spine, uh, you know, a, a birth defect. Mm -hmm. So, you know, what about the L's? You were telling me about the L's three and four. So tell me a little bit more, what's that about? So um, when, you're, when you're born, you, you are supposed to have a fully formed spinal cord, spinal column, bones. Uh, I'm missing my L3, L4 uh, posterior vertebrae. And so when I was born, my nerves were actually exposed uh, through the skin and not protected uh, by the bones. Um, and so the, all of that trauma, you know, damaged the nerves and being exposed to oxygen uh, just damaged them even more, so. So they're exposed, so like, what did your mom say? Like, was she, like when the doctor said that, was you in pain? Did, I mean, not, you wouldn't know, but what about your mom? Did she say you were screaming? Uh, I, uh, actually I had butted the doctor. I, uh, I came out kicking and screaming. I, you know, so I, I had better the doctor when he held me, and uh, then they rushed me into surgery. I bet they did. <laughs> <laughs> so, Ellen, and so how old are you? 29. So, 29 years in the wheelchair. So, you know, now you're here competing, and there's people out there that struggle with so many different forms of, you know, depression, or they think they can't do it, but you did, because, mm -hmm. you know, one of our disabilities is visible, but we all have some sort of, you know, disability. So, what are the encouraging, encouraging words that you could tell to the people, saying, you know what, if I can do it, you can do it too? I just say everybody has reasons to not do it, but don't let that stop you because you don't know what, what you can achieve if you just get out there and do it. You don't know what you can, what goals you don't even know exist yet just by getting out there and doing something that gets you out of your comfort zone. Man, that's great. So you got a couple hardware around your neck, so. I do. What would you place? Let me uh, tell the people. Second in uh, the <coughs> lightweight complete uh, division, and then third in novice. So you got third in novice, and so that he's incomplete. So there's, in nationals here, there's incomplete, incomplete, complete the spinal cord. You know, you can't really move anything. So. He, see, even though all these obstacles that he faced, he's still here doing it, taking action, and that's the outcome. So if you put your mind to it, you can do amazing things, just like Paul. Paul, I appreciate everything. Nick, thank you so much. This is now for the 2022 MPC Wheelchair Nationals. Till next year.